It's Friday night, and this is the best night in. We're watching Dennis the Menace. And during the movie, we're going to show you how to unleash your inner rock star while playing the amazingly fun Beatles rock band. But right now, stay tuned for the movie. I hope you're enjoying the movie. Now we're going to show you how to really rock your best night in with the Beatles rock band. And this is Sean. He's a Beatles rock band expert. He's going to give you a crash course on how to play the game. The Beatles rock band is a new game. You can play along with 45 of the Beatles' biggest hits. You can play on guitar, bass, drums, or singing. Playing the guitar is actually pretty easy. You just hold down the appropriate color on the fret up here and strum when the gem gets to the bottom. Drums are pretty much the same thing. Gems come down, you hit the right colored pad or the kick. Okay, but I saw you guys throwing in a few fancy moves in there though. Yeah, you can, uh, as you build up bonus points, you can lift up to get even more bonus points. And how does the singing work? You plug in a microphone. As you sing along, then you see the notes scroll across and the words and it matches the pitch of your voice to the pitch in the original track. The closer you are, the better you do. Wow, that's some serious competition. It is. Trying to compete with the Beatles is a little difficult. A little difficult. You'll pick it up. All you'll right. Up. Well, I'm going to keep practicing while you guys watch some more of the movie, and I'll see you in a little while. It's your best night in, and now we're going to take a quick break from the movie to show you all about the Beatles rock band. And this is Sean, the Beatles rock band expert. So, Sean, what's going on? So, uh, right now we're playing uh, Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band Slash. With a little help from my friends, we put them together in the in the game so they would sort of fit together. It's kind of how it was meant to be done. That is so cool. Yeah. So, this seems like it'd be a really good game for the whole family, you think? It is. It's kind of the perfect game for the whole family. Uh, you can have up to six people playing. You can have a guitarist, a bassist, a drummer, and then up to three singers uh, doing three-part harmonies. Everybody knows the Beatles songs. There's yes. uh, uh, from little kids all the way to senior citizens. So it's one game where you can really get everybody involved. Now, if you already have the instruments at home for rock band, do you need to go buy the whole Beatles kit in order to play this game? Nope. Uh, if you already have the instruments and a couple of USB microphones hanging around, you can just uh, buy the software and you'll be ready to go. All right. Well, we're going to keep rocking. There's more movie coming up after this. This is your best night in, and we've been talking about new video games that can add a lot of fun to your night in. And I got a question here from a viewer, Josh R., who says, I buy all the latest video games for my family, okay, mostly for me, but I always have trouble convincing my wife we need them. Any advice? Okay, Josh, remember, the holidays are coming up. That means Sears, Black Friday, now doorbusters. The day after Thanksgiving, get the hottest prices of the season on over 599 Black Friday, now doorbusters. Huge, Josh. I'm talking huge savings on everything from flat screen TVs, home electronics, cameras, digital frames, GPS units. There's appliances, tools, apparel, and yes, jewelry, which has been known to work wonders when convincing wives that their husbands need new video games. So Josh, for every video game you buy, buy your wife some jewelry. So go shopping, Josh. Have fun. Happy shopping. If you have a question, just go online to this address below, and we'll have more of the movie coming up right after this. Hey, it's your best night in, a great movie, and we're showing you how the Beatles rock band will totally make your nights in a blast. Okay, let's see, you got the basics down, and now you want to kick it up a notch with some awesome rock star moves to add to your performance. Well, that's what Sean, our expert here, is going to show us. So, Sean, come on, what do you got? Well, I mean, the thing is, if you're if you're playing, you kind of want to put on a show. It's kind of like being a yeah. real musician. You don't want to just stand there with your mouth open staring at the screen. The simple one is, you know, if you're playing bass or... Uh, guitar and you don't really have a part for a little while. Just a little fist bump in time, and that'll help. That'll like that'll that. get it going. It's like simple, that. but it shows that you're really into it. You know, people love being singled out in the room. They like to think the performance is just for them. So, you know, a little bit of like guitar point, like Red Adam. That one's a good one. But of course, the one everybody loves, the one that adds a ton of style to 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 your performance, is just a simple, and you can play it right in time. Oh yeah. Just a windmill. Just a little bit of windmill action. Ooh. Just bringing it up. That's going to make you awesome. All right. Stay tuned for the conclusion of tonight's movie coming right up. All right. You can do both. Hey, I like that. <laughs>